you know, you know who we do care about. You know who we do love and respect, and who we do who we do get upset about when bad things happen to him. That's right. The one, the only, Austin Peterson, aka Boss Man Jack. All right, um, Boss Man. Bossman's in jail, and it's not looking good. He was uh, hit with two charges. One's felony drug possession, which, as we learned from the Ricada case, is quite a high sentence. Uh, each state has different laws for everything, but he's in jail. Um, and the other charge was for assault and battery of a family member. We believe that it could have been Bossman Drew, his brother. His brother was over at around, like, the day before. I think there was some implication that uh, he was moving back in, Boss Man Drew was. So I guess they got into a fight right off the fucking bat. Uh, Boss Man Drew called the police. The police showed up. They found a significant amount of, of drugs on him, so he got hit with the double assault and battery of a family member and, a, and uh, drug possession. This is his mugshot, and his mugshot looks a little bit familiar. That's because he is in the exact same Shared County custodial facility that Christian was. He has the exact same fucking jumper on. In fact, chances are, because I think they just take those jumpsuits out and they just wash them and share them between people, there's a chance that the one he's wearing might have actually been worn by Christian, considering how long he was there. So, um, yeah, that's fucking weird, for sure. Uh, we didn't know what his charges were, but then we got them hunted down. I did a poll to see what people would think was the charges. A uh, simple drug possession, violent threatening offense, automotive incident, unlawful gamba, incest, or other. Uh, my choice was unlawful gamba because I thought that would be the funniest. Only 13 people or 3% voted like I did. More, pe- Twice as many people voted for incest. Uh, simple drug possession was the um, uh, most likely offense, and the second one was a violent or threatening offense. So the two most popular options were actually the correct ones because uh, he got both. Um. And it's real fucking bad because not only is he facing a felony charge, um, Bossman was on paper, which means that he was on parole, I believe, or probation. I forget the name of that. But he had a susp- suspended sentence. Uh, and when he, There's a misconception that when you're on probation or parole or whatever the fuck, that you're a free person. You're not. You're still a ward of the state. You don't have the same freedoms as a free person does. They can come to your house at any time. They can drug test you at any time. There's limitations on your freedom, and you're still you're st- you're technically serving out a jail sentence as a free person, so you're accountable to um uh, to the system. So when you are in that when you're like a ward of the state and you commit another felony, it's bad. It's bad, and he's looking at serious time. Um, I'm not sure if the guy counted that, but it's like years in jail. And it's also serving the rest of his sentence out, which is also years in jail. Um, that is a class one misdemeanor, which is, I think if a year in jail is a class one misdemeanor. I remember that from Christian. And then a class five felony for possession of scheduled one or scheduled two, which I think, I think a class one and a class five is like a wobbler. Um, I think a class five, I remember this specifically from Christian, a class one misdemeanor is one year in jail and a class five felony is 10 years in jail. So that's up to 11 years in jail. Um, if he gets hit with the felony at the full, the full charge, plus also potentially the remainder of his sentence on his paper. So whatever he has to serve on his, uh, probation or whatever, like that's a lot of time. So we may never see Bossman Jack again on this podcast. Uh, it's a real opportunity, which has led to the elation of certain rats, such as Kazu Kifin, who apparently is a pink triangle fit, and then also a listener, says, Oh no, looks like Noel has to find a new gambling schizophrenic faggot to fangirl over. I always skip the Bossman Jack segments on Maddie because I didn't find them entertaining or funny. Just spam dumb or ma- dumb autistic and Maddie, stay felted BMJ fangirls and fanboys. Sir, do you seriously think... That the boss man Jack content, the boss man tent, stops here. Um, I hate to be the one to tell you, buddy, but it never stops.
says, E wake up, pussy. Uh, uh, I have to press L, I gotcha. Welcome to the world of rats. My name is Jerry. People call me the Rat Professor. This world is inhabited by creatures called rats. For some people, rats are pets. Others use them for fights. Myself, I study rats as a profession. First, what's your name? Let's see, which one do I want to pick? I'll go with Bossman. Keep it real. This is a rigor. He takes all of your money every single day. What is his name? I think Evil Ed. That's right. I remember now. His name is Evil Ed. Boss Man, your own Gamba legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with fat stacks awaits. Let's go. All right. Let's see. All right. I can walk around. Try to sleep. I can't sleep with money still in my wallet. Um, I can't leave with money still in my wallet. Boss man found a carpet nug chat. Oh, there's a hole in the wall. I think this is where you're supposed to go, chat. <laughs> the volume is loud. Okay, hold up. I'll drop it just a little bit for you, chat. There we go. Oh my god, I'm up so fat on yes, no. What's your Addy? I'll send you a juicer. Oh, we got juice chat. You want to flip a coin? Yeah, obviously I want to flip a coin. Big shmoney chat. Yes! We did it! Yes, dude, let's go! I think I want to flip another coin chat. Big shmoney. Oh my god, I'm, I'm up I'm up huge chat. Now there's a little smiley face when you start to gamba. I just got 15 juice. I just got like a, what was that, a 5 extra? I got another 8 juice chat! I can't believe it! Nah, no, that's fucking rigged, bro. They do this to you, they let you win, and the Oh my god, 15! Come on. Chat. Chat, I think that I think we're getting a Porygon at the end of this one. Now it's fucking rigged. When you see the magic carbs, you know you're fucked. Yeah, this is rigged. Yeah, this is fucking rigged, bro. Fuck this. I'm not screaming enough. Take that, you ass. Okay. I'm buying some more juice with all my money. I th it's do, don't go. It's not do. I think that this is the switch. I saw a preview. Hey, a switch behind the poster. Flip it. Who wouldn't? I, there's, um... There's a video. That switch is in the original game. That's how you know. This is fucked, bro. I flipped the switch and everything. Come on. Bro. 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 Are you guys seeing this? I'm just fucking losing everything. You're fucking rigged. Hold up. Maybe we should go back to yes, no. I think that that's the right option. No. I needed that! Oh wait, there's a door. This is the Mewtwo theme, this isn't. <laughs> oh, there's no so dialogue for Evil Eddie. This is just the rat headquarters, I guess. He doesn't want to talk to me. I don't have enough money. Maybe there'll be another version where there's, uh, you can, you can kill Evil Eddie, because he's a fucking rigger. 
No. I can't fight Evil Eddie unless I have. This is bullshit. It's just fucking eating, bro. Fuck this. Maybe there's a switch inside of Evil Eddie's lair. So I'm just gonna like tap A. One of these has to be a switch. You're fucking up if none of these are switches. My confidence in finding a switch down here is sinking, unless this is the one. No. You need money? I don't want money. I want to lose. So I'm playing. I gotta deal with Take.us, but they don't let me keep any of the juice. I wish I had a 100% raw, real sponsor. <laughs> Maybe this one's lucky, chap. No. Bro, the juice was better before... I'm gonna flip the switch back. The switch... The switch is flipped and it will not budge. This is fucked. He blocked off the, the, the gate. Yo, I got the best stuff that you can find. You want a cop? Oh, the magic rock is... <laughs> Get your broke ass out of here. It's a sign. Rigger Game Quarter, the playground for grown-ups. And this says, coins exchange for prizes, prize exchange. Oh, I can buy a rat. Body armor, big Bufords, or sneakers. There's no Porygon. Oh, there is a Porygon. You have to have 9,000 now. Okay, I'll take the Rattata. I'll just leave him name. Maybe now that I have a Pokemon, I can fight Evil Eddie with my Rattata. I have a good feeling about this. Oh my god, I was right. It would always find the perfect moment to flip the switch. Okay. Oh, we called him a cunt because he's Australian. That's some deep lore right there. Oh, he has six Pokemon. I'm fucked. How the fuck am I going to be... Oh, it's a level 100 <laughs> Oh, a bubble beam. He's fucked. Oh, he shit. It's a critical hit, bro. I'm up fat. Oh, this is easy. Look at this. Another critical hit. His spec attack is so high, chat. Oh, I'm fucked on this one. I don't even... I don't even remember a Super Fang in the game. Is that like a real move? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Shit. Rattata fainted. Bossman has been felted. <laughs> Bossman blacked out. And you just, you just appear in your game. Okay, I got you. Okay. I'll call it. I call it quits there, chat. I just had to rub it into Kazuki Fane's stupid fucking face that the content never stops. All right, don't get it twisted. It is fucking rigged. Though. Don't even. Don't try me. Um, <laughs> I had to wait. Possibly you can download this. By the way, it's on the forum. Um, it's called the Rat Version. It's in the Bossman Jack thread. I'm gonna give him a good old. A Chivo sticker. I know those are quite coveted by the rats. Excellent. It's yeah. It's on the Kiwi Farms. It's in the uh, Bossman thread. Uh, it's at post one eight seven five zero eight seven zero or twenty one thousand five hundred forty eight in the thread. Yugalus Sneed for two says free my Bossman Jack. You didn't do nothing, dude. We gotta go. We gotta go free that name. 
We got to go in there. We got to get some. I, <laughs> Hardin says he's not he's not particularly interested in taking his case. We got to find somebody for him that can get him out for because he's a good boy. He didn't do nothing. We got to get Evil Eddie has the fucking money. Hire him, Johnny Cochran. For God's sakes. Just a famous butt for two says boss man's arrest is a rat rigger conspiracy. I agree. That's actually also true. Very true. Uh, Tetraback for Fidiala says rats just hate on Bossman because he stacks paper to the ceiling and rides on 24 inch chrome and then blows it all on a five minute crack fueled coin flip bench for everyone's enjoyment. Do the rate, the haters that hate Bossman have hate themselves really truly. If you think about it, like what's wrong with them? He didn't do nothing to them. And yet they're so full of haterade. Sad is what it is. <laughs> 